Hey, this is Tim bringing you words of grace today from the Queensboro Bridge on the Queens side, the 59th Street Bridge, and we're thinking about the, the Wednesday before Easter Sunday. I'm going to call it a wait day, a, a weighty day. Uh, we think of, of weight coming upon something, and look at this structure behind me. Kind of wonder how much weight this thing could hold. Uh, no doubt, quite a bit of weight. Uh, I'm sure some engineer somewhere knows I saw the Brooklyn Bridge holds 18,700 tons. I don't know how they came to that number and thought, okay, no one else step on here. We're at a breaking point. This, like 170,000 vehicles go on this bridge every day and thousands, 5,400 uh, cyclists, 2,000, maybe 2,000 cyclists, 5,400 pedestrians, just a lot of traffic each day. When we think of Wednesday before Easter Sunday, I think of it not as a wait day in the sense that not much is given, uh, not much is recorded about that day. In fact, you follow the gospel events and a lot of Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday is developed and then a whole lot of Thursday and Friday. Right? The Gospel of John gives five chapters to just Thursday evening, but not much Wednesday. And so we think of Wednesday as a silent day, as a waiting day. Uh, no doubt a lot of planning and conspiring is going on. Uh, by those who are going to put Jesus to death. But I, I think of it as a weighty day in the sense that Jesus is really feeling the weight of the world coming upon him. Thursday night, he is going to even buckle under that weight in the sense, in his humanity, as, as he's emotionally handling this, he is going to sweat drops of blood and, and cry blood so much emotional, spiritual pressure is being placed upon him. And we know what that pressure is. It, it is the pressure of the physical excruciation of, of the cross, uh, but much more than that. This is the, the, weight of the, the, the weight of the sin of the world. Right? He who knew no sin became sin on our behalf. Uh, he will be the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world. He's going to have to be the bridge that, that just under pins that heavy weight. Isaiah 53 says he bears our sin as a sacrificial lamb. And so that is the greatest weight uh, of Wednesday as Jesus senses this coming, uh, the sin penalty for all of us. And, and of course, the excruciating part of that is that in, in this mystery called the Trinity, the Father is going to condemn the Son in our place, and Jesus is going to suffer the penalty for our sin. An amazing, amazing love that Jesus died uh, for our sins, paid the penalty. And no doubt we think of Wednesday, we think of Jesus sensing that and feeling the weight, the weight of the world beginning to press hard on our Savior's shoulders. So thank Him for Wednesday. Thank Him for being the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world.